Hey guys, I'm back with my second review. Um, today I'll be looking at another holster, slightly different than what I did before. Uh, this is the Sticky Holster. Uh, I carry my Smith & Wesson MP Shield in here, and I will be using this later on for some other videos just on how to do some simple gunsmithing and uh, simple stuff to your firearm, just make it a little bit better. But today, focusing on the sticky holster. Try and get that clear. There we go. Um, I love this. I carry it every single day. Uh, running out the house, whatever I'm doing, whether I'm dressed casually, whether I have a collared shirt on, looking good, <laughs> um, this works perfectly. I can fit it anywhere. It's not bulky at all and it stays put um it's made of kind of a neoprene material it's not actually sticky as the name would suggest but it really does cling to your clothing and your body i've never you know had any issues with my firearm kind of sliding or almost falling out i've been using this for about six months now on basically a daily basis and really couldn't be happier um it's really held up well over the last six months you know i have a little bit i can't even really see it in the camera but a little marking little scuffing but that's to be expected uh it still clings to my body perfectly and i couldn't uh suggest this really anymore um with all the other types of holsters i mean you got you got your you have your Kydex, you have your injection molded, your leather, and I am a fan of all of them. They all have their place, but for just simple running out the house, really doing anything, this is what I would, you know, what I enjoy carrying. Um, one complaint being the material, it, you know, it is soft and if you draw your firearm, yes, the holster collapses. Now, as I'm out and about, if I need to draw my firearm, I'm assuming that the least of my concerns is going to be the holster collapsing. At that point, I'm not going to be too concerned with reholstering my firearm, so it's not really an issue. When I'm at the range, yeah, it can be annoying, but overall this product is really well made uh really holds up well it's cheaper than a lot of its competitors which is definitely an upside um again i really just couldn't you know i couldn't suggest sticky holsters any better or any more the website i'll put it down in the comment section below is uh stickyholsters.com and as I'm going about making these videos, if anybody has any questions or any comments, please uh, feel free to leave them below and I will get back to you. Um, I'm going to be using this channel to do recordings on different uh, pieces of equipment, EDC stuff, some products, and then I'll also be using it, you know, show you guys a little bit of how to's on the gunsmithing. Um, how to paint, you know, how to lighten your trigger, just little stuff like that. If you guys enjoy it, if you like the channel, if you go ahead and subscribe, that'd be awesome. But, you know, there's a lot of people on here and there's a lot of opinions out here and I try to stay away from those. So, I hope you guys enjoy and I hope you have a great day.